guys welcome back to my channel so for today's video i'm just gonna show you guys a very easy um way on how i edit my videos using imovie on the iphone this is a free app it i believe it also comes free in your phone so um let's just go ahead and get started so um you can see i am screen recording so so i'm just gonna open the imovie app right here so as you can see i do have some videos i'm working on so um what you're gonna want to do you're just gonna want to go ahead and press the black square with the with the plus sign here and then it's gonna give you two options if you want to do a movie or a trailer i usually do movies because well that's what you actually want to do so you can go ahead and press movie and then from there it'll take you to like your pictures and you can just um, choose whichever video you want or photos so i'm just gonna get a random video here just give me one moment so i'm just gonna choose this one of my son pretty random but yeah you can choose that one you can choose more than one you can choose that one and then that one and then on the bottom where it says create a movie you can see how long your movie is um, but for now i'm just gonna go ahead and add one so from there you're just gonna want to go ahead and press create movie and it'll put your movie right here or your video right here and then so on this this is where you start editing everything okay so from here um, let's say you want to add um, another video um, to the end or to the front you can add it either anywhere you want so if you want to add another video you can just go all the way to the end you can press the plus sign and then here you have a lot of options of like stuff that you can um, input into your video you can put videos photos um, audio um, you can even do a voiceover and then the camera is just in case if you want to add like a picture from right then and there so um i'm gonna go through each one just to show you guys so let's do the video so from here you can just add whichever video you want so i'm just gonna add this other one of my son as well so as you can see it just adds it to the end of your video like i said you can also import it to the beginning however you want so um, i'm just gonna delete that video and then just add like a photo to the end so you're just gonna want to go back go to photos recently added and then um let's just put this banner that i just recently made so it adds your picture to the end as well and then here you can, the pictures you can make them as long as you want you can shorten them up make them longer however you want and then these options on the top right hand corner it's just if you want to like um, um enable the ken burns that means like um once it goes from this clip to that clip it kind of like moves but i don't like that so what i do is i just click on that and then um push on the ken burns enabled and then from there it just doesn't move it just stays there so i usually use that and then so i'm just gonna delete that go ahead and insert something else and then from here like i said you can always add um like music you can go to your songs but as you can see it immediately shows you which ones you can't add so it's pretty nice and then um you can go to sound effects it does have a lot of sound effects here so you can use those as well and then and then of course the voiceover the voiceover is just if you want to add a recording somewhere so um um let's say you want to add a recording there you can just um or you can just choose wherever you want to put the voiceover and then um you can just press record it'll start recording like let's go ahead so it'll start recording here and then from there um, whenever you want to stop you can just stop it you can either cancel it retake it you can review it or you can accept it which um, will just enter it to your video cancel you it'll just delete it by itself retake you can just retake it of course so that's how you can do a voiceover and then so yeah that's pretty much it for the ones where you want to add stuff and then so now with the basic editing so what i like to do is um let's say you want to like delete some clip that doesn't even look great 
so when you press on your video you get all of these options at the bottom okay so let's say let's start off with the scissors one so let's say you want to split it it'll split and then um, you can either delete it or you can detach it duplicate whatever you want so if you detach it it'll just detach the sound from it and then um, it won't have sound on it anymore and then um and then so let's just delete the sound and then if you want to duplicate it it's just gonna make a sec it's just gonna like repeat it again so that's what that is and then of course delete you just delete it and then so and then you can also like choose which um theme you want to do like it has that one and then it has the dissolve one it has to slide this one you have four options on doing it like if you want to slide it to the top bottom left right you can choose that one wipe the same thing right left top bottom and then fade as well and then and then from there let's just move to this little like clock thing from here this is where you can speed up your video or you can slow it down whatever you want and then um these the freeze add and reset those i never i never actually use them and then the volume one you can turn up the volume or turn it down however you want and then of course if you want to add text to it like um you can just add whatever you want like let's say um it's just for baby so it'll come here and then of course if you don't want to put anything here you can just tap those and um press the x and it'll it won't come out anymore so that's what it will look like and then from there you can also press this little like filters i never use the filters just because i don't like to use them but yeah those are the filters that you can use and then let's say you want to do like a zoom in or out what you could do is you can select the clip that you want to zoom in and you just press press the clip and then you can press this little magnifying um, glass right here on the top right hand corner and then this is where you can like pinch in to zoom in and then you can like position it wherever you want and then so let's just say you want to zoom in there so when you play the clip the clip it's going to look like that and then it'll go back to its original size and then let's say you want to do like a picture on picture or picture on video type of video all you can do what you can do is go to add you can go to your photos video whatever you want to insert you can insert it but for this case i'm just going to do a photo so again i'm just going to use um the template that i have so from there instead of pressing the little circle with the plus sign you're going to press the three dots and this is going to give you all of these options so if you want to put like a picture on picture you can do picture in picture and then this is what it's going to look like so in the place it's going to be playing your video and then with this picture there so you press the picture that you imported and then it gives you these options on the top right hand corner and the little arrows that's where you can like position it and then also you can like either like resize it or make it smaller however you want but yeah and then oops sorry i don't know what i'm doing but yeah so that's pretty much that and then so let's say you don't want to have it there you can like split wherever you want to start it you can just press and drag to wherever you want to have it and then from there this is what it's gonna look like yeah, no. and then that's where it's gonna pop up okay so it's pretty simple pretty easy this is why i love imovie because you can just literally do it the most simplest way and it's just amazing and then on this little settings on the um bottom right hand corner you can just press it and it'll give you more of like project filters and then like theme so each them each theme does come with its own like colors and like settings and like fonts and stuff and then they also have soundtracks and then um you can add those if you want but i never use those
and after that you can just press the done button and it'll um, take you to the screen right here from from there you can just like either save it delete it whatever you want upload it to YouTube me personally I like to save it first I press the little box with the arrow and then I just put save video and then from there it gives you options of like HD 1080p or something like that I always press the HD one and then from there I just save it to my phone and then that's when I upload it to YouTube yeah guys that's pretty much what I do to edit my videos um, if you guys found this video helpful please give it a huge thumbs up also comment down below what you guys think and also if you guys are not yet subscribed go ahead and do so right now but yeah guys that's pretty much it and i'll see you guys in my next video